and whatever i will tell to you you are going to think in your mind okay whatever i'm going to tell to you you'll think in your mind okay keep your eyes closed imagine this is the last period of the day and the school bell is ringing Tring. you all pack your bags say your prayers and you are moving out of the school okay you are moving out of the <coughs> perfect you are moving out of the school out at the school gate keep your eyes closed and think keep your eyes closed and think out at the school gate there is a big van and in that van there is ice cream chocolate flavor ice cream mango flavor ice cream strawberry flavor ice cream pineapple flavor ice cream and the ice cream seller is giving ice cream for free today close your eyes close your eyes come on you all are running towards the ice cream van and you take your favorite flavor keep your eyes closed and think you take your favorite flavor and nicely eat your ice cream Everyone ate ice cream. Nice. Once you eat the ice cream, you go back to your home. You remove your shoes outside the door. You go to your house. You change your clothes and you come out for lunch. And today, for lunch, your mum has made pasta. Nice cheesy pasta with lot of cheese in it. Everyone finish your pasta fast. Yes. Everyone ate the pasta. Yes. Drink little water, and you come back to your room. Everyone keep your eyes closed. Once you come back to your room, on your bed you find my abacus cake. Is everyone able to see the abacus cake? Yes. Very good. With your eyes closed, you pick that abacus cake with both the hands. And keep it on a table. Everyone's abacus scale has main frame. Very good. Your abacus scale has lower beads. Does your abacus scale has lower beads? Very good. Does it has upper beads? Does your abacus scale answer line? Yes. Does it have unit dot? Yes. Now all push all the lower beads down. Eyes closed. Push all the lower beads down. And upper beads up, make it zero. All the lower beads down, upper beads up. Done. Everyone did it. Yes. Very good. Now with your eyes closed, I'll tell you sums. You're supposed to do it on the abacus scale, okay? Do two plus one again plus one. What is the answer? Very good. Clear the back scale. All the lower beads down. Upper beads up. All the lower beads down. Upper beads up. Make it a clear back scale. Next question. Okay. One plus two plus five plus one. What is the answer? Very good. Clear the back scale. Very good. Close your eyes. Imagine the back scale, main frame, lower beads, answer line, upper beads, unit dot, rod. All the lower beads down, upper beads up. If the answer is zero, and now we'll do the question. Do five plus four minus two minus one. What is the answer? Very. Good. Loud and clear. Six is the right answer. Clear the back scale. Make it zero. I want everyone to give the answer. Okay. Focus. Keep your eyes closed. Focus. All the lower beads down. Upper beads up. And we'll do the calculation. Come on. Close your eyes. Be ready. And everyone will give the answer this time loudly. Okay. Four plus five. Plus five. Minus three. Minus three. Minus one. Minus five. Minus five. Plus four. Plus four. Minus two. Minus two. Minus one. Minus one. What is the answer? 
very good. Clap for yourselves and keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed. We will go for a bigger number. Okay? Keep your eyes closed and we'll go for a bigger number. Everyone, keep your eyes closed. Make it zero. All the lower means down. Upper means up. We'll do the next question. Five plus four minus five minus four plus two again plus two plus five minus four minus five plus two plus one what is the answer Very good. Is it magical? You all like magicians, you did calculations, right? Yes. You are able to do the calculation without using paper, pen, pen, pencil, just in your brain. And you all were like human super calculators. Clap for yourself. Okay. Students will learn one more trick. Last trick for the day. Okay, how many numbers can you calculate on your finger? Ten. More? Can you calculate more? No. No? You want to learn how to calculate 99 on your fingers? Come on, I'll show you a trick. Okay? Close your both the thumbs like this. Both the hands. Close it. Close it like this. Everyone close it like this. Just Put your right hand up and the left down. Okay? Now, you have four fingers? Yes. You have four fingers? Yes. Now, the value of each finger is one like our lower bead. Okay? Yes. And the value of thumb is five like our upper bead. The value of thumb is five. The value of thumb is five. So, make it zero like this for zero. Observe here. Zero. This is one. This is two. This is three. This is four. Okay, make it zero back. Make it zero. And our thumb is our five. Thumb is our five. So this is five. This is five. five. This is our abacus five. What is this? Five. What is it? Five. five. Okay, make it zero again. One. What is this? Zero. Zero. What is this? Five. Five. Five plus one? Six. Plus one? Seven. Plus one? Eight. Plus one? Nine. Nine. Okay? Clear? Now again make it zero. This is your one sign. This is your ten sign. This is your ten sign. So this is one, two, three, Okay? Now, 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 your left hand also. Left hand also. Keep your both hands. Now, one and zero. What is one and zero? Ten. One and zero? Ten. This is zero, right? This is what? One and zero? Ten. Two and zero? Three and zero? Four and zero? Five and zero? Six and zero. Seven and zero. Eight and zero. Nine and zero. Nine and one. Ninety-one. Nine and two. Nine and three. Nine and four. Nine and five. Nine and six. Nine and seven. Nine and eight. Nine and nine. See, I showed you you can calculate 99 numbers on your hand. Very good. Clap for yourself. Give your line the
boy is magical. Yes. Students, come on here. Last time, did you all like the backers? Yes. Was it magical? Yes. Is it interesting? Yes. Do you want to learn this? Yes. Very good. Thank you very much. You can, as the teacher instructs, you can leave for your classrooms. Okay. Thank you very much, students. Thank you, sir. Tell them to stop there. Stand that side. Okay. Yes. Stand that side. Oh, come this side now. Perfect. Okay. Hey, stand this side. Stand here and get up. Why are you acting here again? Stand and face the words you serve. Sir, it's going to teach you. Can I press the side? Go, go. Shall we start? Yeah. Yes. Everyone is nicely seated on the chairs. Yes. 
I was standing nicely standing, but this of that girl, you stand behind. Very good. You want to sit? Come, sit in this chair. Come here, come here, come here, fast. Stand here. Okay. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Very good. How are you all? I am How are the sports? Nice. Yes. sports? Yes. Very good. Nice. Come on. How many of you likes to see magic? Very good. Hands down. How many of you would like to do magic? Yeah. Very good. This boy, if you dance here and there, you go outside the class. Stand in one place. Very good. Hands down. Hands down. Hands down. Hands down. Okay. Now, come here. Come here. Come here. Yes, you come. No, no, no. That's why. Yes, you come here. Come here. Yes, you come here. Come here. Yes, you come here. Come here. Come fast. Come here fast. I said, sit here. Yes, you sit here. Come here, come here fast. No one will do anything. So stand there only. If you dance here and there, you open the door, I'll make you sit. Okay? Now, how many would like to do magic? Very good. Hands down. So today, I'm going to teach you something with which you all will be like magicians. You all can do magic. You want to learn that? Yes. But for that, there is a rule. And the rule is, everyone in the class will give answer. Okay? Yes. And everyone will keep quiet. Okay? Everyone in the class will give answer. And everyone will keep quiet. Okay? Only when I'm asking answer, that time only you will open your mouth. Okay? So now, how many of you find maths difficult? Maths difficult. Come on, hands down. Today, after the magic that we are going to learn, maths will be like this easy. And you will be do, able to do maths in a magic way. In a magic way. You all will be like magicians of maths. Okay? So let's learn something called as abacus. Something called as? Whenever I ask you to say, you will say it loud and clear. Okay? Today we are going to learn? Very good. This thing in my hand is an abacus scale. It's called a abacus scale. scale. Okay? Now, like our human body has certain parts, this abacus scale also has parts. This abacus scale also has parts. Now, outside thing, can you see this outside thing? Yes. This is called main frame. This is called main frame. Can you see some beads here and here? So the beads on the lower side are called lower beads. They are called lower, lower beads because they are on lower side. So what you call the beads that are on upper side? Upper, upper beads. Very good. You all are smart. Clap for yourself. Okay? Observe here. Observe here now. Stop. Main frame. What is it? Main frame. Lower beads. Lower beads. Upper beads. Answer line. Answer line. You see this line in between, right? Mm -hmm. This is called answer line. This is called answer, answer line. line. And can you see this black color dot? Yes. This is called unit dot. This is called? Unit dot. And this thing are called rods. This thing are called? Rods. Come on, once again. Main frame. Main frame. Lower beads. Lower beads. Upper beads. Upper beads. Unit dot. Unit dot. Answer line. Rods. Rods. Now, can you see all the lower beads are on lower side and upper beads are on upper side? Yes. Is there any bit touching the answering line? No. No. So the answer is zero. The answer is yes. zero. Since none of the bead is touching this answer line, the answer is zero. From the last, the answer is zero. zero. They, they last students were there. The answer is zero. zero. Now, the, this side. Can you see how many beads are there on lower side? How many beads are there? Three. Huh? Four. One, two, three, four. How many beads are there? 
4. Now this means the value is 1. The value is 1. And whenever I want an answer or I want to add something, I move this bead up. Okay? The value of lower beads is 1. The value of lower beads is 1. So now, if I take one bead and I last bench over there, two boys, two girls. Now, if I take this bead and I touch the answer line, it becomes answer. What is the answer now? One. One. Very good. If I take one more bead and I touch it, now what is the answer? Two. Two. One plus one, two. Okay? These are all one. One plus one, two. two. Now what is the answer? Three. Now what is the answer? Four. Now what is the answer? Zero. Now what is the answer? Two. From the last side, what is the answer now? Three. Now, what is the answer? Three. What is the answer? Four. What is the answer? Two. What is the answer? Zero. Very good. Now, the upper beat, the upper beat value is five. The value of upper beat is? Five. The value of lower bead is one. The value of upper bead is five. five. So if I bring this bead down, what is the answer? Five. five. What is the answer? Five. five. What is the answer now? One. Loud. One. Two. Three. Three. One. Zero. Zero. Four. Four. Two. Zero. Five. Five. Now. 5 plus 1. I am taking 1 beat. What is the answer? 6. Very good. Now what is the answer? 7, 8, 9. Okay. Now what is the observ observance? Is? What is the answer? 7. Huh? 7. Now? 6. Now? 5. Now?
Very good. Plus one. For plus one, what we'll do? Bundle up. Minus five. What we'll do for minus five? Upper. Upper. Upper beat. Up. What is the answer? Three. Very good. Clap for yourself. Now, who will come here and do the sum? Come on. Someone will come here and do the sum? Who wants to come here? Yes, come. What is your name? Can we clap for him, please? Come on, do. I'll tell you the number, okay? One. One. Plus five. Yes. Plus two. Yes, plus two. Minus five. Minus five. What is the answer? Three. Can we clap for him? Come on, next two will come. Yes, come that one. Okay, two plus five plus two minus five minus three plus five minus one minus one. Yes. What is the answer? Huh? Very good. Can we clap for it? Who is the next? Come on. Okay. Three plus one plus five minus two minus five minus five minus one. What is the answer? Can you clap for it? Okay. Who all wants to do it? Yes. I will. I will make all of you do it. But before that, we'll do a match. Then everyone will get one by one turn. Okay? Everyone will get one by one turn. Let's do a magic. I want you all. Those are sitting. Sit. Those are standing. Stand behind. <coughs> huh? Oh. Okay, everyone, close your eyes. Everyone, close your eyes. Very good. Now, we are going to do a magic. And this magic will only happen if you keep your eyes closed. You want to be a magician, right? You want to do magic? Yeah. To do this magic, you want to keep your eyes closed. If you open your eyes, then you will not be able to do magic, okay? Keep your eyes closed and think whatever I am telling to you. Okay, with your eyes closed, you will think whatever I'm telling to you. Imagine that this is the last school period of the day and the school bell, bell is ringing. Pring! You all pack your bags, say your prayers and you stand in the queue to come out of the school. Everyone is coming out of the school. You also came out of the school. And outside the school gate, today, there is a big van standing. And that van is full of ice creams. And it is giving ice creams for free. It has chocolate. You are not supposed to say it. has a chocolate flavor ice cream. Mango flavor ice cream. Strawberry flavor ice cream. And it is free. So you go and take your favorite flavor of ice cream and eat it fast. Everyone eats ice cream? Very good. Now, after eating the ice cream, you are going back to your home. Everyone reach their home. You remove your shoes outside the house. You go inside the house. You change your clothes. You wash your hands and you go to eat your lunch. And your mamas made pasta for the lunch with a lot of cheese on it. Nice cheesy pasta. Come on, everyone eat it fast. After eating pasta, you drink a little water, wash your hands, and you move to your room. 
in your room, on your bed, you find my abacus cane. Everyone is able to see? Yes. You lift that abacus scale with both the hands and keep it on a table. Your abacus scale has mainframe. Does your abacus scale has mainframe? Yes or no? Yes. Does your abacus scale has lower beads? Yes. Upper beads? Yes. Answer line? Yes. Unit dot? Yes. Rods? Yes. Very good. Now push all the lower beads down and upper beads up. So it's a clear abacus. No bead is touching your answer line. All the down, lower beads are down, upper beads are up. So what is the answer? Zero. Very good. I keep your eyes closed and I will tell you some numbers to do and you are supposed to do it. Okay? Do. One. One. Plus two. Plus two. Plus one. Plus one. What is the answer? Zero. Very good. Very good. Keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed. Keep your eyes closed and move all the lower beads down, all the upper beads up. We'll do next question, okay? Two plus five plus two. What is the answer? Very good. Put all the lower beads down, upper beads up. Okay, we'll do the next question. Okay? Four plus five minus four. Minus five, minus 5 plus 2, plus two. again plus 2, yeah, plus two. Minus, one. minus 1. What is the answer? Three. Very good. Close your eyes, close your eyes. See, you all are able to do this magic. Put all the lower beads down, upper beads up. We'll do the next magic. Okay, next question. Ready for it? Okay, the question is come on. 2. Plus two, plus two, plus five, plus five minus, five, minus five, minus four, minus four plus, three, plus three, plus one, plus, one, plus, five, plus five, minus two, minus four, again minus two, again minus, three, minus, five, minus five. What is the answer? Zero. Yeah. Very good. Clear the Rabaka scale. We'll do one more sum and I'll go a little long, okay? All the lower beats down, upper beats up, make it zero. Five, five. plus four, plus four. Minus, five. minus five, minus two, minus two, minus two. Minus two. Plus, four. plus four, plus five, plus five. Minus, five. Minus, five. Minus, five. minus two, minus, two. minus one, minus plus, three. plus three, plus five. What is the answer? Nine. Very good. Open your eyes and clap for yourself. Was it magic? Yes. Was it magic? Yes. You are able to do. You are able to do your mathematics without using pencil and paper or without using your fingers. Just in your mind, like a robot. You are all human calculators. Clap for yourself. Okay, do you have tables? Yes. Do you yes. have tables? Yes. You all want table of nine? No. Yes. Yes or no? Yes. No? Yes. In what the numbers table you know? Yes. Okay, no one will make noise. Everyone here? The last page. Observe here. This side. You know table of nine? Yes. Yes or no? Yes. Very good. What is nine ones are? Nine. Nine twos are? Eight. Nine threes are? Eight. Very good. Do you know shortcut to table of nine? Yes. What is the shortcut you know? Yes. One, two, three, writing on the board? Yes. On your fingers? Yes. Yes? yes. How do you not tell me? <laughs> Who taught you? Yes, who taught you? Okay, come on, we learn magic. Everyone, rub your palms together. Open your palms. 
from from your left thumb from your left thumb students from your left thumb towards your right thumb we number each finger keep your hand like this in front of you we number each finger one your left hand thumb is one two three four five six seven eight nine ten every finger we are giving number observe again one two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Keep it like this. Keep it like this. When I say nine ones are, you will close only that finger which we are giving number one. Which finger did we give number one? Thumb. Just close it. How many fingers are left? Nine. Nine. What is nine ones are? Nine. <coughs> Very good. Open it back again. When I say nine twos are. You will close only that finger which we give number two. Which finger did we give number two? This finger we give number two. Yes. Just close this finger. Now after closing this finger, towards the left of this finger, how many fingers are there? Eighteen. One. Right. After you close this finger, towards the left, how many fingers are there? One. Towards the right, how many fingers are there? Eight. One. Eight. Eighteen. What is nine twos are? Eighteen. Open it back again. When I say nine threes are, close only that finger which we give number three. Which finger did we give number three? Come on, show me everyone. Finger. This finger did we give number three? Yes. Close it. How many fingers on the left hand side? Two. Two. How many fingers on the right hand side? Seven. seven. Two seven. Two. Twenty-seven. Nine threes are? Twenty-seven. Open it back again. Nine fours are close the finger which we give number four. This finger towards the left. How many fingers? Three. Towards the right. How many fingers? Six. Six. Three six. Thirty six. Nine fours are. Same way you can do nine fives are, nine six are, nine sevens are, nine eights are, nine nines are, and nine tens are. Is this easy? Come on, everyone. Yeah, last bit. What is going on over there? Yes, you. Come on, everyone. Is this interesting? Yes. Did you all like it? Yes. What is this thing? Abacus. Abacus. Thing. What is this thing? Abacus. What is this thing called? Abacus. This thing. Lower beans. This thing. Abacus. This thing. On the right. This thing. Very good. This thing, what? Very good. This thing is called as a backus scale. This thing is called a backus scale. With the help of a backus scale, in your mind, you can do additions, subtractions, multiplications, divisions, integers. All the tables just in your mind. Is this nice? Yes. You are like it. Yes. Last bench. You are like it. Yes. It is interesting. Yes. How many want to study on this abacus? Very good. Clap for yourself. And slowly you can move back to your classes. Slowly without making noise. Without making noise.